So we're going to show you how to make this fantastic skeleton. Okay. So we're going to start with sock number one, and we're going to turn is it, it inside out. This is the whole thing, that right here. That is the here. whole thing. Okay. And we're going to kind of, I'll walk you through the progression of okay. sticking it all together. So we've turned them both inside out. Okay. In sock number one, you're going to put... Clean. Clean oh, socks. Oh, absolutely. Clean. Okay. Yes. Clean <laughs> socks. With the heel on the underside. Okay and the toe running across the top. Okay. Now I've marked the cut lines in red and the machine sew lines in blue. Oh, okay. And of course these templates are all on MarthaStewart.com so you can download them from the website. Yeah, right here, look how great this template is. <laughs> and you just multiply it to what, uh, how many times? Uh, actually, it doesn't. It's just to uh, see the cut lines. You don't even have to. Oh, enlarge oh, okay, it. okay. So just so it's as not you a print pattern. It out, okay. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. So what we're going to do is take our wheel cutter and our straight edge, and we're just going to follow along the blue line, the red cut lines. Oh, the red. So this first sock will become the head, the torso, and the legs. And you can see now we've separated the legs, and he will be turned. I'm still cutting. Okay. I'm. I'm waiting for you. I'm still cutting. <laughs> And so this now, if you don't have a wheel cutter, you can use a scissor. Oh, absolutely. Yes, okay. Yeah. No, it just tends to be a little bit faster. Okay. And so you've left an opening, though, between the legs, and that's what we'll turn the sock inside out with. Okay. And so, I mean, right side out. Right side. Right, yeah. exactly. And once he's turned right side out, we'll fill him with stuff. Oh, this is, oh, this is already um, it's sewn. It's already sewn. Oh, oh. So how are you going to turn it inside out? Right. So we're just turning. Oh, just each leg. Exactly. Oh, okay. Right. And then we have our, our stuffing here. Which, uh, this is actually bamboo stuffing, which I love. Okay. It's really nice oh, it and is. soft. Oh, it is. It's so soft. So that's like bamboo cotton. Exactly. Oh, I love yeah. it. And it's I actually, it's, it. it's a little bit denser than your poly, okay. which is really nice. So we're going to move on, and we actually have him already stuffed now, and we've hand sewn the opening closed. And what we're going to do is form the head. So we'll do that with a length of black embroidery floss. Okay. And just lay that down. Doubled? Uh, yeah, you can double it up. And then we're going to cinch it around. Choke him. Choke him, exactly. <laughs> okay. Once around or twice? Uh, you can do it once or twice, as long okay. as you get a good tie. So now we're choking him to right. death. <laughs> and you'll okay. tie him off and see. You've got your little head there, and we obviously would snip so off. Obviously, you make these a lot. I've I'm made quite a few of them. Depth at this. And then I want to show you what we do when we move on to sock number two. And uh, we have the progression laid out. Very the cute. Foot of the sock. When it's cut, again, I've got the cut lines shown oh, there yes. for you. Is cut, we turn it uh, right side in and we so pin it up. So this is arms and longer legs. Exactly. Oh, all right. Yeah, the foot becomes the forearm pieces, which you see here and, that and are all And the toe pins. is going to be discarded? The toe will be discarded as will the heel. And then they'll yeah. become these forearm pieces here once they're turned right side out and okay. uh, so Well, I'm shut. getting much better at this. There, there you are. go. Yeah. So I want to show you a little trick for how to stuff the arms okay. and legs quickly. You're going to take the sewn end and just kind of cup it in a little bit oh, like that. Okay. And then take your piece of batting next to an unsharpened pencil. And we're going to tuck a little bit of the batting over or the top. Or a chopstick. Or a chopstick, absolutely. Or a small the piece of dowel. Uh huh. Oh, this whole right thing. Right alongside. Okay. Tuck a little bit of the top over the eraser end. Okay. And then you're going to set that cupped portion of your leg right there on top. Oh. So it's like putting a quilt into a comforter exactly. cover. Yes. And then you're okay. just going to you can roll it right down oh, on top. Oh, look at this. Oh. And so it's super fast. Oh, that's so fast. And then you take your pencil and you can just use that to kind of yeah. get the rest of the batting down and in you there. Look. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> and then you'll tuck your raw edges in, and then these will be hand sewn shut. Okay. So once you have all of your pieces, we're going to give you him all attached. So you can see the leg see? bones connected to yeah. the hip bone, and the arms are all there. Right. So uh, next we're going to create the ribs. And so what I've done is I've marked the inside points of the ribs with a straight pin. And you're going to take a length of embroidery floss, and you're going to enter on the back side. Right behind the green? Right behind the green, exactly. Okay. It's just kind of mark where you want to come out. Okay. Now watch out that you don't... Yes. Don't stick yourself. Pull it through the front, and you're going to wrap it around, enter exact same spot, come out the exact same spot. You're going to do this two or three times just to get oh, that a has nice... A knot, that has a knot on it already. It does have oh, a knot okay. on it. And see, so when you start to cinch it up, the rib forms there. And if you do that two or three times around and tie it off, it, uh, it becomes one of the ribs. And you'll repeat that oh, a few huge. more times. Okay. And you can see here, with all six ribs attached, 
The mouth is created in just the same fashion where you're cinching it around. And we've stacked button eyes on there and sewn them on also with the embroidery this is charming. floss. Charming. And he's all set. And, and about, there you and have And his him. eyes you sew on? The eyes are sewn on with the embroidery floss. Okay. And that's how you make a skeleton out oh. of a sock.